Hello everyone, you welcome back to my YouTube channel called the Fashion Aficionado. My name is BP. I talk about lifestyle, fragrances, fashion. If it's your first time here, please go ahead, like, share, subscribe, hit the notification, the notification bell so you get notified anytime I upload new content. So today I'm gonna to be talking about a fragrance, but let me digress a little. If you guys like this shirt, I actually have or this polo, I have like four polos from this brand, and trust me. Almost every of the polos I've worn, I've gotten a compliment. If you guys want like a full video, please put it down in the comment section below. I'll do like a full review of the clothing brand. But without further ado, let's get right into the actual fragrance we came here for. So this fragrance I'm here to review is a clone of Kayali or Kayali. Some people call it Kayali, some people call it Kayali. Kayali is um, Yomi Pistachio Gelato. So it's a very sweet, gelato-ish, pistachio-ish kind of fragrance. So this here is a clone. This is called, this is from the house of um, Paris Corner, from the Amir line. This is called Cahir Pistachio. I don't know if this is gonna focus. I don't know which works best. But looking at the box, I think I've already done a shot of how the box looks. So this has like the Paris corner here. This has like a nice design to it. So this has like some leaves here, like some palm leaves. Yeah, it's a cool bottle. And the color, this color scheme is similar to that of the Yummy Pistachio Gelato from House of Kiali. I'm gonna put a picture somewhere here. And the body looks like this. The body is lovely, like it looks really good. But this is plastic, but from the outside it looks good. Like you can see Cahir Pistachio, you can see the cover and this looks very plasticky, it's starting to peel off but as long as the atomizer works, that's fine. So this is how this looks, you can see the bottle. Okay, so let's get right into the note, right? So one of the first notes here, like the name says Pistachio. You also have um, ice cream on the top note, bergamot, hazelnut, cardamom, rum, and in the mid note you have pear, raspberry, white peach, peony, jasmine, garnium. Then in the base note you have whipped cream, you have marshmallow, cotton candy, tonka bean, and cedarwood. Like. As the note says, like you can see the notes on the screen, this is very sweet. Like it's, <laughs> if you have a sweet tooth, you actually gonna love this. This belongs to my wife. She actually owns the bottle, but I'll be helping her wear it from time to time. But she's the one, like she bought within the first one month and a half. She but she just kept wearing it because she loves sweet fragrances. Like she, it's the whipped cream, the ice cream, the um, the pear. Everything just comes in, but it's it's very good. For me personally, I'll say, what's going on with the cap? For me personally, I'll say for a, for a lady, a lady can wear it all year round. But for a guy, this will be too sweet for you in summer. That's just my personal opinion. You can wear whatever you want. But personally, I won't wear this in summer. I wear this in like fall or winter. Where if the weather is cool, that will actually help tone down the sweet, sweetness a bit. Because left to me, I don't wear very extremely sweet fragrances in summer. So, but this is, this is, I can say it's almost the sweetest fragrance I've ever, because it has cotton candy, you saw in the notes, cotton candy, whipped cream, ice cream, anything you can think of, marshmallow, anything you can think of that is sweet, it's almost in this fragrance, it's very sweet, but it's sweet and fruity at the same time, but it's lovely, you're going to get compliments, it's, yeah, it's almost a given, like if you're a guy, if you're a lady wearing it, most likely other ladies will compliment you, if you're a guy wearing it, most likely ladies will compliment you, because it's very sweet. I have a cousin too, like, really smelt it, he says he's gonna go, go buy it, he just loves it already. It's a lovely fragrance, and I think it lasts about six, seven hours, if not more. I need to try it out. Then, uh, this is, not, the bottle is, looks good too, but it's just plastic. But the fragrance in it, if, I haven't smelt the original before, but if this is how that smells, yeah, they did a good job. But this is very, if you love sweet fragrances, you'll, if you don't like sweet fragrances, mm, you can still try it out, buy like a sample or something. But this is very sweet. Like, this is very sweet. But it's good. It's fruity and gourmandy and 
yeah it's inviting so like this is this is good will i recommend yeah for people who love sweet fragrances or like to wear sweet fragrances for certain occasions you can you might want to try this oh this is lovely and this is just for like 35 dollars compared to kaylee's like 120 150 depending on where you buy it or maybe 200 it's your choice you can go spend on that or this is a good alternative there's also another one from i think latafa called affection i haven't tried that out before but this is i think this is from what i've from the research i've done this is pretty close to the original yeah for the for my fellows there with um ladies and gents that love sweet fragrances you need to have this in your collection like it's a must for the people who love sweet fragrances if you like sweet fragrances try it out that's what i'll say yeah okay i've come to the end of this video guys please don't forget to like share subscribe hit the notification bell so you get notified anytime i upload new content and i always appreciate you for coming always i say please invite your friends over this is a unisex fragrance so i review some unisex fragrances sometimes so thanks a lot guys for watching stay safe out there if you have any comments please put them in the comment section below i love interacting with you guys stay safe Peace out.